What do you mean? Miguel? Miguel's fine. He was okay. Look at him. Miguel's fine. He's back there. Well, my family's dead, so uh, I, don't, I don't care about dying. I'm an old man. It's okay, Harold. We only have to run for a bit and then we can rest for ages. It's okay. Okay. I just need to get the Gorka. This will probably turn into a hold up. Probably not a full gunfight, but I will hold this guy up as soon as I see the opportunity. Be prepared. And we're going to come in like the cavalry. I hope my life kicks in by then. Is that enough to become a tiny battle? Yeah, it, all it takes is one tiny little nibble. Oh, brilliant. Who are we shooting? A guy in an orange armband. Okay, cool. When we get there, okay. Adel, or bodyguard, it's going to act like his friend, so we're holding him up as well. Only engage orange armband. If he pulls a gun out. Let's get in the nitty gritty. I'm ready for the nitty gritty. So is Harold P. Winks. Oh, if only Scott could see me now, eh? Dressed as Miguel. Wearing his berry. Scott would know I'm wearing it in memory of Miguel. And he was a sweet guy. Damn, did he taste good. You look like Miguel. I brought Miguel back from the dead. Done that, to Harold P. Winks. So we are going to sneak up from behind him, have them lay down, put your hand on their head, and then I'll apprehend. Wow, I like it. So, so again, what's the guy happen? in the orange arm band. I don't suppose there's time for me to go for a wee right here in this bush. Uh, not really. Okay, I'm going in. Let's just go in. It's up there. I went outside. You know. Hello. Uh, lay down, please. Pull out a weapon. You will die. Put your hand on your head. Me too. Hands on the head. Hi guys. I didn't hey, know where you were. Hands on your head. Don't turn to see. Good. Um, Stay I don't there. think I have my handcuffs on me. Oh, oh, don't worry. I come prepared. You always come prepared. How P. Winkerman came prepared as well. Uh, somebody else play as the other guy. Sorry, buddy. No, nothing personal. I just heard you were wearing an orange armband. Okay, please, both of you all stand up. Follow me into the hospital. You want to separate him? Yeah, I'd say separate him, yeah. Uh, Go to the hunter shop. Yeah, you Start walking. On. Keep him in here. If he tries to break out, hit him a few times. If he continues, kill him. Okie dokie. How hungry are you feeling, Harold? <sighs> feeling pretty hungry right now. Okay, guys, let's... It was the orange arm band that spooked us because of the yeah. um, association towards cannibal hunters. I yeah. was I was gonna say it's a big misunderstanding. I found an orange raincoat on the coast and I cut it up to make an armband just in case if I found mm. someone who was friendly. Hey bud. So we did hear you were pulling in uh wearing an orange armband. That's mainly the reason why we took you in here. I literally haven't met anyone else other than my friend. And you guys. Don't take on so kind of I don't... Hey Teddy, come here. So what's your favorite color? Huh? What's your favorite color? My... Well, yeah. <laughs> believe it or not, blue is actually my favorite color. What's your name? Uh, my name's Vance. 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 You can call me Vance. Good to meet you, Vance. I'm Alex. Vance. I'm Harold P. Winkleman. Well, good to meet you. I mean, I wish you we were on better terms. Yeah, you know, we all hope for the best. I can't think of any reason why things would turn <laughs> crazy. Trouble is, I'm getting real hungry. Yeah, I mean, I got like chicken and, and like strawberry jam and things like that if you're hungry. I suppose I could tide us over for now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You sure I can tie this over for now? What is your stance on uh, cannabis? Ah, yeah. The ghost of somebody else to carry them. This person, he didn't quite make it. Ah. And so we had to help carry him now. I have personally never tried it. Um, Would you like to? I never really thought about it. It's totally your choice. I mean, we're not going to, you know, we can't insist, but if you wanted to, you can. I mean, I was going to say, I, I kind of am tied up, and you guys are both. Heavily armed, so you... I'm going to strip you down to your boots. I'm gonna lay you here over here. This does not mean you are dying. <coughs> I just want to ask you a few questions. You wanted to try some human meat? Uh, I'll get to that in a second. Okay, I'll leave it there for now. 
if uh, you and Harold don't mind stepping out so I can talk to this guy. Of course, of course. Oh, I got it, I got it. Just patrol you the area. In the room, as you can tell, our group of cannibals, but not all of us are cannibals. There's a few of us that are not. We're like a family, we take care of each other and only each other. But with being cannibal, we have a religion, philosophies that we follow. Well, I mean, you do, I don't share those same philosophies. Oh well, yeah, but... I drink the Kool-Aid. Harold, you should go talk to the prisoner, um, and ask him if he's interested. Harold! What? Stay with the new recruit. Uh, okay, welcome. I'll oh. grab the new guy if you like. Yeah, do not I'll, kill I'll the new the guy, door. he's one of us. <laughs> hey, bud. What's up, fellas? There you go. You must be cold, I, f I feel sorry about you not even close to Um... <laughs> <laughs> He's got a good face. <laughs> hey, nice, nice day outside. Yeah. Hey, look at, this, look at this poster of human anatomy. Oh, it's you! Oh man, we we came up here thinking it was we caught ourselves the tourists. No. I was gonna uh, say we might eat our next tours. Take those. Yeah, you, you guys would Hi, have Alex. had a pee see you again. <laughs> so what's his name? Did you, did you see some things too, or have you already been scarred from your past? Ah, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm Kane. Remember? <laughs> no, because my real name's Abel, and then I switched to the other brother. That's understandable. Ah, it's good to see you with some clothes on. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I want to get the basics down about uh, around you, Vince. So, where are you from? Um... Uh... Uh... I'm originally from New York. I'm obviously no longer there. Yo, Rhino. I don't yeah. know. I don't, I don't sound like it's. You might come another this way for a minute. Sure, I'll be right back. Okay. What do you need? Uh, just a, an update. Anybody have any food? Uh, yes, I do. Um, and I've got some proper human food. Yeah, I hope so. I want none of that poor bacon. <laughs> All right, listen here, Vince. So, yep. me and Harold uh, are tasked of watching over you. So, we're kind of your boss right now. <laughs> It's not really a, a, a debate thing, but, um, so what do you guys think about or the defects? Good. Uh, I'm, totally I'm warning you ahead. They will, they will <laughs> no, listen, if, if you guys, if you get like, try to defect or run away, they will put a bullet in your kneecap and eat you. A lot. Yeah. I will slowly is... cut off it. Every part of your body, and I hate you. Some of the, most of the people here are crazy. They'll do whatever they want, and that's fine. This is what happened to the last person that tried to run away. Be <laughs> so <laughs> each other. Be gentle okay. though, because uh, the only other person you're Ill. allowed to be with Thank is Harold. You. I'm gonna feed you a little piece. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's yeah. What do you think, Bangle? Excalibur? I know you liked Rhino, but what do you think about Bangle? I think Bangle was also good. We've got such good names. Harold, what's your name gonna be? Uh, Harold Pink Winkle. Sticking in houses. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know about you guys, but I think it's about time <laughs> to hunt some tourists. <laughs>